Good morning, everyone. I am starting my Friday morning with a bowl of fruit, my daily supplements, and then some Coco Kind coffee. My room is super messy. Cleaning it is on the agenda for sometime this weekend, but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit of the day. I'm wearing this black TNA top and then these light, like dusty blue TNA leggings. And then I have my little Fiat Robin Konkin bag. And I don't really have any makeup on today. I just have my eyebrows on. And then I have like a little bit of Too Faced Lip Injection Gloss. And that's my Wilma girl. I'm about to leave her because I'm about to go out with my mom. Hi, Wilma. You want me to give you a little cookie? Do you want a little cookie before I leave? This is Wilma's little cookie station. She's been having a hard time eating these lamb ones. So I'm going to give her one, but I'm going to watch her eat it. <gasps> Good girl. turned into a little shopping center with a little antique shop and we just found the most perfect shelving unit for my new house and it was only 125 literally I've been looking at these on Facebook marketplace and they are no less than like 200 bucks but oh my gosh the man inside he was so nice he said 125 for this it's in amazing condition I'm so excited. These are the other things that we got. Um, my mom got a little framed photo and then she got this, this like nice little small table. We're gonna put a plant on there. I am just so excited about this. What a day. So this is the shelving unit inside my house. Well, inside like my house with my parents, but we're gonna be moving in some furniture tomorrow to the house that me and Justin are moving into. And I'm just so obsessed with this. Like, I cannot believe that I was able to find a piece that looked this good. $125? $125? Yes. Yeah, crazy. And then I also got this small little piece, just like a little decorative piece to go on it. It's like a pinky, peachy cuteness. And then I haven't shown these on my YouTube channel yet but I picked up these chairs, um, this one, and then there's another one. I picked these up from OfferUp. I got the set for $350, so it was like a little bit more expensive than what I wanted to pay, but I really wasn't seeing chairs that I was liking, new or used, for any less, and I got two of them, so I'm obsessed with these. Like, these could not be more perfect, like pinky brown nude, are you joking me? And yeah, it, the shelving unit just looks so good. This is like sort of what I have envisioned for my beauty room, obviously having a little bit more spacing between these and then maybe like a plant in the middle, but just so excited. And then my mom is cleaning up this piece a little bit. This we found at Goodwill for 40 bucks. Mm -hmm. I do have to put like or find, I think we're gonna end up making a little cushion for it, but I love it. I don't know if it's going in my house that I'm moving into. We'll see if we have the room for it. Um, but yeah, this piece is really great. It was a bargain, 40 bucks. You see these on Facebook Marketplace all the time for way more. Also on Facebook Marketplace, I was able to find a dresser and two nightstands for 150, which was so cheap. They're not like, I'm not totally in love with them. They're not like uh, pieces that I love or will like carry with us probably in our next house, but they'll do for now. They look very nice. They, it, you know, it's just a nice piece of solid wood furniture and I got them for $150. Like they'll be perfect for what we need them for. But this I am just obsessed with. I can't, I cannot wait to, dec to decorate my little beauty room. And then I just came home and I got this package from Urban Decay. They sent over the new Stoned Vibes palette. And this honestly looks really, really beautiful. I'm curious to see the texture of these because I know I really love their moon dust shadows, the glitter toppers. I wonder how similar these are to that. But it comes with two pretty decent matte shades. This one's a matte. And then this one looks like a satin brown that probably you could use as a matte. And then 
palette's really sturdy. It kind of reminds me of like old Urban Decay, which I think is kind of cool. And then they did send over a primer potion. I already have a primer potion. I'll probably save that and donate it or like gift it to somebody else. So there's not really a great angle for me to show you guys my dressing recipe because I don't have a tripod right now. I've lost it for my little camera. But I am going to show you guys how I make my salad dressing. My salad dressing is the bomb. It's so good. Yeah, it's using apple cider vinegar, olive oil. It's all stuff that you guys probably already have in your house. And it's just seriously so good. So let's get started. Yeah. I did buy a homemade salad dressing dispenser. I got it from Amazon and it's really cool. It's like a perfect size for my dressing. And it also has little measurements on the side. So I start out by using a half cup of olive oil and I'll just measure it out on the actual container. So a half cup of olive oil. I'll take another half cup of apple cider vinegar. So I'll just measure it out to the one. And I go a little bit above because I really like apple cider vinegar. Like I love vinegar. I just add some spicy brown mustard to it and I don't measure out anything. I don't really ever need to. I just kind of eyeball it and I'll just add a little bit. Same with my honey. I will add quite a bit of honey. Maybe just a little, a little extra more. I also add minced garlic. I don't usually, like I do prefer actually cooking with fresh garlic, but I think for something like this where the garlic is gonna be raw, I really prefer jarred minced garlic. I just think the flavor is a little better for when the garlic is gonna be raw. And then I will take a lemon half. Oh, you matched the first thing, huh? Yeah. Isn't that perfect, Dad? Yeah. My dad's seeing my shelf for the first time. Yeah. No. Like a little like antique treasure store. I'm actually gonna add the other lemon you have half. A lot of, uh, back and forth this weekend, huh? Oh, to the house? Yeah. Then I just screw the lid on, make sure the little nozzle part is secure, and then shake it up. You just shake it up really good for like a couple of minutes. You don't need to blend it up in a blender. You can. I think it comes out a little thicker when you blend it out blend it up in the blender right away it comes out a little bit thicker but this does thicken up in the fridge anyway but it's still really good freshly made Saturday, my boyfriend and I are going to be meeting um, our friend Sam, who is who we are going to be moving in with, and just kind of discussing our move-in plans and what that is going to look like. And we're also going to be talking about, I'm sure, about moving in some furniture today, which we got the go-ahead to do, which is exciting. We're gonna be moving in the dining room table, the coffee table, hopefully the shelf, and the two chairs that I got from OfferUp. We're gonna start moving some things into the house. So this chair, probably the coffee table, kitchen table, some nightstands, and then my mom's car has some stuff. So we have the kitchen table chairs in here, some hangers. We're just gonna keep some stuff there, you know, stuff that we had been holding on to for a little bit. And then we also have some stuff in Justin's car. So this is what the living room looks like when you first walk in. So we have like a bunch of stuff going on right here, but this is gonna be the living room. Obviously we have the kitchen right over here. And then this is a little hallway, probably a little closet. I haven't seen this. Oh, that's kind of nice. And then this is going to be the little filming room. I'm so stoked for this. We already have the shelf in here. Um, and then I'll insert like a little picture of what the shelf and the chair looks like. It looked really cute. Closet right here. I'm probably going to be putting a lot of my clothes in this closet because we don't have a closet in our like bedroom where me and Justin are going to be. And then um, this is our bathroom, me and Justin's bathroom, my, Justin and I's bathroom, I guess. I love it. I love the wallpaper. How freaking cute is this wallpaper? Obsessed um yeah and like really nice storage in the bathroom these come out and then cabinet some drawers and yeah really love that 
and then coming through here this is where the boys are going to set up their own office so we're thinking we're going to put a desk here and then a desk here and then we are going to put like a mini fridge and a microwave in here which will be nice and then here's another closet i forgot to turn the light off in here so just walking through the kitchen this is what the kitchen is looking like um i'm gonna have to like I feel like it's going to be a struggle to maybe keep this a little bit organized, but we'll work out a system, I'm sure. Pantry, we are lucky enough to have a really big laundry room. So this is where the washer and dryer is going to go. And then I think we're going to get like a utility shelf for this space right here. And then this is the bedroom that me and that this is the bedroom that Justin and I will be in. So this is where we're going to put our dresser that we got right here. Um, <laughs> these are my roommates. And then, so our bed is gonna go here. Nightstands are gonna go on either side. And then this is the dresser that's going to go on this wall. And this dresser and these nightstands, I got off Facebook Marketplace for $150. Just a bargain. But, and what, but what? But they were dirty. Yeah, well, we'll clean them. Found, they look- We found somebody's undies in them. We also found a bra insert, but <laughs> we will clean them. We'll get them cleaned and looking right. This is, you know, we didn't know, I didn't know that that was gonna be there, but yeah, it's, okay. it's all good. But yeah, this is the house. And then the backyard is really big and pretty spacious. So coming out here and then this is the backyard, it's huge. Hey guys, it's Sunday now. I'm getting in my dad's truck and we are going to go out to eat. Oh, it's like getting foggy. It's kind of hot in here. But we're going out to eat. We're gonna have to find some place that has outdoor seating, of course, and enjoy our Sunday. Um, Dad, you're gonna get me copyrighted. Why? Because of the music. It's really all um, I have planned for today. We're just going out to lunch, just my parents and I. And then I do have to clean up my room. I need to make sure that's cleaned. And then I think I'm gonna go over to Justin's house later and we're gonna watch the VMAs together, but not all the VMAs. I really just wanna catch Miley singing Midnight Sky because that is probably my favorite Miley song since Space Boots. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have on the agenda today. Dad just ordered this avocado with tuna on top of it. This looks so good. Where was this on the menu? Yes, ma'am. Okay, you can put um, $3 on. Okay. So we just stopped to get snow cones. I always get tiger's blood and grape. Mom got Georgia peach, right? Yep. And then mom also got a little size of marzipan. <laughs> oh, thanks, dad. Could have been hit or miss. Yeah. So. 